Banger fans, I am thrilled to welcome you to the final battle in Shredders of Metal 3 Drum Edition. We started with eight drummers shredding skins with beats and fills. We're down to two. Shredders of Metal 3, the final episode, epic drum duel. If you've watched Shredders before, you know our finals are an exciting back and forth duel. So what's gonna happen is, one of them's gonna start, the other's gonna take over, and we're just gonna do that back and forth until, I don't know, the building gives out? It really depends on the drummers. I mean, everybody's gonna have a different style. Some people are gonna be better at improv than others. If I'm lucky enough to make it that far, I'm just gonna enjoy the chance to play with whoever else is on that other kit, because I think it'll be super fun. For this competition here, I'm gonna be feeding off of the person beside me. Just push me that much more. No idea what I'm gonna do. That one there is just, show us what you got. So let's get to it.
I think I can confidently say that's how you do a final. Come on. Yes, sir. What we experienced here, without overstating it, it's musicianship of the highest order. So impressed by both of you, but at the end of the day, we do have to choose one over the other. So I'm gonna tell you who I chose and why. So I went with Derek. Wow, thank you. Vito, I gotta be honest, I was coming into the final kind of leaning in your court. I've said it in previous rounds, like your feel and the way you play the drums is just magic to me. But what happened for me with that round was that I saw something in Derek that I don't think I've seen quite before. And there was this ability to be technical and versatile. You expressed yourself with volume. I had some uh, Sean Reinhardt, rest in peace, Gene Hoagland moments like <laughs> in there, like when Death Human came out and we heard Reinhardt do the the symbol work with it, and we were all going, what the fuck's going on? Like, you were doing that today. It was beautiful, so I chose you as the the master shredder. <laughs> Thank you very much. We've got one vote for Derek, but we have two more down the line. Ollie. Well, first off, guys, congrats for both of you. It was awesome, but we have to chop at some point and decide, you know, who's gonna be the winner, right? So I went with Vito, basically. Why? Technicality, I think Derek wins, no doubt. In terms of speed, uh, coordination, top bottom, intricacy in terms of playing, really cool stuff with the cymbals, the bells, all that. Very, very tasty. Out of the box thinking as well. But ultimately for me, what drumming is about is about power. It's about groove. Um, Vito was like a little John Bonham at the beginning. It was really <laughs> awesome. So he was a little appeared earlier, and now John Bonham. He has this classic snail, you know? Congrats, guys. All right, we come down to Chris. You were the odd man out a couple times. You get vindicated. You get to be the decider now. Uh, How are you feeling? Incredibly uncomfortable. <laughs> <laughs> um, that was, I've never seen anything like it. I absolutely loved what both you guys did, and it's been an honor to hear both you guys play. Uh, Vito, you have an incredibly unique style of phrasing things, and, and just the confidence and natural talent like I've, I've never seen. I mean, it is so fun to watch you play. It is so natural to see you having fun and doing it effortlessly. There's an economy of motion to everything that you do, and it is very unique in, in your own way. Um, Derek, whew. Uh, your power and precision have not been matched like the whole time. It's It's been, very, very impressive and incredible. I was thinking while you were playing, you know, if Terminator was a movie about drums, <laughs> you, you would fucking kill everybody. <laughs> <laughs> so it is, it's almost impossible. You know, it's really subjective and um, both you guys uh, really impressed me. And, and I hate to pick a winner and I've always been, in my friends and, and being around other drummers, it's always been very friendly. It, competition is a weird thing because we seem to have a way of getting along with each other that maybe some other people that play instruments like bass don't. <laughs> but, uh, with that all said, uh, today's winner is Derek. Derek, you're our winner. How does it feel? Uh, a little surreal, kind of uh, at a loss for words. So, we do have to present you with something. Obviously, a strap isn't gonna do you very good unless you're doing some snare stuff in a marching band. So, uh, we have our Shredders of Metal 3 Drum Edition Championship skin to present wow. you. It's amazing, thank you. And there's another small prize of uh, just, uh, just the, the, a, a key uh, to your brand new drums! <laughs> Courtesy of our good friends at Pearl. Uh, I don't know how you're getting it home. You've got to carry it on the bus. Yeah, yeah. And Vito, from our friends at Los Cabos, we've got gig bag, some sticks. You'll lose a lot of them, so I'm sure it'll come in handy. <laughs> For sure. So that's been Shredders of Metal 3 Drum Edition. A big thanks to our fantastic celebrity guest judges, Chris Adler, 
Ali Baudouin, and and all of us at Banger Films. Thanks for coming on this journey with us for a third year. This has been Shredders of Metal 3, Drum Edition. Just let's close it out. A big round of applause for drumming! Woo!